morning guys so today is saturday the 13th uh it is moving day it is moving day we are leaving norma's house now this is probably the easiest and less stressful move i've ever had to go through because my stuff is in storage so it's already in boxes it's already packed we're just mo meeting the moving company there and from there we're going to the house i think for me what what is the most stressful about moving is actually packing your own stuff you know so this is actually a bit stress not stress free per se but it's actually not as stressful as i thought it would be so we just what it's eight o'clock now we're supposed to meet the guys the moving guys at nine but they've already called to say they're on the way so we're probably going to meet them at half past eight um hate that they are already on their way but love it also then it means we'll see by latest 10 o'clock will be done 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 so just norma and i will be unpacking in the house and then it's going to be easier then to see what i have what i don't have so i can write down everything that i need to buy because um i may be moving today but i'm not moving into the house today i just i i i, I was planning on moving in december but because i wanted to secure the place i took i took it in the middle of the month so i'm just gonna move my stuff now get to the place make sure that everything worked yesterday um when i was doing the empty apartment tour we tested the stove and stuff but we didn't test the plugs so i'm just gonna test if the plug works because you know you have like seven days to report anything that is that could be broken so we're gonna do that and um yeah let's move Okay, we just got to the storage and um, the guys were on time, well, well super early, but um, we're about to start the move now. I'm so excited to be done with storage and moving into my place. Okay, we're almost done. Um, they're now just trying to figure out where to put what. I didn't realize that I actually had a lot of stuff. I should have hired a bigger truck. But um, these guys are good at what they're doing, so they want to make it fit. My favorite part. Well, I guess my favorite part is when they leave my house. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Yeah, nothing so, broken. But this is my first favorite part. Which is? Then wrapping up means that we're done. So now they must just unwrap. And they're not unpacking. Just like. Unload? Unload. Saturday English is gone yeah and then yeah i'm actually excited now. yeah i'm being genuine now
Okay, Mama and I are gonna take a break and we're going to eat. And we just also ordered some drinks. But I mean, we've done, like we are, we've done a lot. Let me show you guys. Noma and I are done, so we're taking a break now. We're about to just eat and, you know, drink a little bit. Because it's more, I have more boxes than I thought I did. So I underestimated the amount of time we will spend here. So, but we've done a lot. We've put the beds upstairs. Um, so upstairs is fine. The rooms are fine. We've put the beds upstairs. What was the problem? We had a lot of boxes in the kitchen. But I mean, this is our progress. Okay, that's Norma's food and drinks. We just need to move this couch around. It's this the way it's, it's now. It's not how it's going to be. These boxes are done. This is my bookshelf. We just need to put books. Kitchen. Microwave is unpacked. Small Anyana boxes. We've got Norma unpacked those for me. Oh, those are my drinks. That's in. Yeah, there was a lot of boxes here. We are done. Noma, Noma's done a lot. Um, and I'm going to say Noma because I, I've i been flaky. But I mean, we're almost done. But we're going to eat now and chill. So this one is a four tier, but the one in Alwanda's room is a three tier. The one in Alwanda's room, Noma has done it. And now she refuses to help me with this one. So I assembled it myself, but it, like it's falling apart and Noma is just, it's not helpful. So, oh, then I need this other one, eh? Hmm? Yeah. No, 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 actually. Do one side. Yeah, do one side. Is it easier? Because, yeah, it's going to be difficult trying to slot in between. Okay. Yo. Yo. I don't do shit like this, Minaka. It's like, put me in the kitchen, I'll be fine. Like, I don't... for this I feel like there are people who are made for this and I'm not one of them and that's okay because big ah. no ma you're busy <laughs> I'm literally having a meltdown I can't do this can I do the clothes I need to do this You just took it out it's for, but it, it sh should it be just should it be this easy to just take it out because you're only putting the nails in now so one after you've put in the nails ah, cut the cameras dead ass a few moments later so we are done officially moving and now it's just um What's left is just to add on things, but we have put together some things. It's starting to look like a home. So this is the entryway. I don't have a table here, but I'm gonna get a table here and a nice family picture. In the meantime, we have the house rules and they include in this house, we do second chances, we do real, we do laughter, we do love, we do I'm sorry, we do hugs, we do family, we do mistakes, we do loud very well. <laughs> We do creative and we do teamwork. This, are, these are the only house rules I have in my house. Well, I mean, amongst others, but these are the most important ones. But I don't like this here. 
Um, we definitely want a family picture here with a table, so that's something to add. Here, still not sure what's happening here. Bathroom, we just added a tissue and some hand wash for now. And in the family room, my couch fits nicely. Um, oops, we have the, the, the rug. It's white with kids. It's not a good idea to have a white rug, but they need to just behave and be clean. That's all they need to do. So we are short of a TV stand, a TV, and a coffee table. Hopefully those are the things I will have, I will have by the month end or end of December. But by the time the kids get here, we will have this sorted out. Um, so yeah, this is the lounge area. And then we got our bookshelf here. I don't know if it's going to stay here because it gives little room to pass by and go outside. So I like it here, I really do, but I'm not sure if we'll, we'll, we'll see when the coffee table gets here. I will see how much um, space we have. If the coffee table is not too big, we can just like push the couch forward and this then at least will make space for here. And then on that corner there, we have just like a little. No more promise to buy me flowers, so she's gonna buy me flowers to add here. Just a little candle here. Nothing special can come here. And then with the curtains, I'm going to go to China Mall to go get like curtains properly measured and nice curtains. So Unoma suggested we do like sheer curtains because everything else is just so. I mean, this couch is quite overpowering and it's grey. So I, and the walls are also quite dull. So we don't want black curtains or, or grey curtains. So we're probably just gonna get sheer curtains this side and this side and that's it that's it for the family room maybe we'll have some pictures hanging we'll see i'm tired though i don't know if you guys can tell we got here at like nine o'clock it is now probably four o'clock kitchen almost done so the guys um, installed this for me that's great unpacked the microwave don't mind the beds unpacked the utensils so for utensils right and pack some utensils. So the only thing missing is the fridge. I gave away my fridge last year when we moved. Um, I mean, earlier this year when we moved, I gave away my fridge. So my mom promised to buy me a fridge. So I just need to talk to her about that. Um, we here, I guess a dryer or a dishwasher would go here. I'm not interested in any, none of those things. Maybe a dryer would be nice, but not, not anytime soon. Our pantry is still a bit empty because I haven't bought groceries, but um, I've got my air fryer there, I've got the blender, and I've got my spice rack over there. It's it's big enough, food will still be fine here. We have um, the breakfast nook. Because we don't have an island, this is gonna be basically our breakfast nook. Maybe I should actually get like, maybe a bar stool for here. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe. Mm -hmm. I maybe I can actually work here. Well, so you can take my one. Because yeah. it sits outside. Yeah. yeah and see how it works. Because how it works. I don't have space um, to put my work study desk, well, my work desk, um, in the house. So I work a lot at home. So I'm going to need like a space to work. Maybe this for now, but uh, the sole purpose of this area is like a breakfast nook. So we've got our kettle and we've got our toaster. And here is going to be where our teas and coffees are going to be. We've got our little cookbooks that I never use, but they're really, really good. And when people come to my house, they think that I'm really good at cooking. And they think I use these, but I don't. But yeah, this is our little breakfast spot then, slash study, study area, I mean work area. Okay, upstairs. Okay, and then we get upstairs. This is this box with miscellaneous stuff that I need to sort out. And then this storage box, it has like old curtains and some old linen. So these will be probably Amanda's curtains that she will change whenever she changes these. And then coming to Amanda's room. Uh, a bed, a headboard, and that little, I got that thing like a couple of years ago and I actually liked it in that color, but I think it's about time we repaint it. So she'll repaint it in whatever color that she wants. Um, I guess, I don't know if I would say her room has a theme, but it's quite neutral with these. I love these curtains. I got these curtains from Mr. Price. Absolutely. I got these curtains from Mr. Price a few years ago. 
Yeah. When we moved to Forest Hill, mm. I think it was 2018, 2019, and they still as good as new. So I love these for her. This is a hockey stick. She's a hockey player, so this one she'll have. A little study area. Um, this is yeah her space. This is a a bottle filled with letters I've been writing for her over the past couple of years. The plan was to give them to her when she's 16. She's 13 now, but I think that she's ready. So basically, this is just like advice. You know, like, I don't know, see if I can read one. But it's just like advice I just wrote for her about what to expect in life. Um, this one says, the depth of your compassion lies in your ability to forgive yourself. Always forgive yourself, my babe. Like, this is something that I've struggled with, forgiving myself. Okay, I'm going to read one more. <laughs> um... You are the only person that can heal you, heal yourself. Like these are things that I would have wanted to hear at a younger age and the things that I've struggled with. I always tell her which album to listen to if she's going through a heartbreak. Something is also here about, um... oh my gosh, I think I like this one. I'm gonna read this one. Now I'm being that mom. I forgot half of the things that I've written here, but it's things that I would have liked. This is heaven is whatever calls you home to yourself. If it's love, then walk in it and be in it. If it's art, then create and exist in it. If it's God, then find a mirror and read this again. She does not know that this exists, so she will read this whenever she gets here at her own pace, at her own time. Anyway, so this laundry room is done. This is empty because her clothes are not here. And then we come to Alana's bathroom. Mm -hmm. Come to Alana's bathroom. I just added like these mats. I've always had them, so it's not like I bought them. This one I've always added. And then Noma helped me put this together. So this is from Pep Home. It is 300 Rand. If you guys want it, it's from Pep Home. I think it's really, really cute to just like make it a storage. My room, not completely done. Um, I just we just put these sheer curtains because we ran out of we ran out of these hook things. Um, so we've got these for now. Um, my bed is done, so my bedding is from my old bedding. I just need side tables that I need to get hopefully at the end of the month. Um, wardrobe is I've packed, unpacked all my clothes and my bathroom almost done. So we just need the mirror that I'll probably get my end. Everything I'm, 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 I don't have, I'll probably get this either end of November or end of December. Um, I can't afford to buy everything at once, but I also have the same thing that Arwande has. This is also from Hip Home. The difference is that this is a four tier one and Arwande is three tiers. Um, it's really, really cute. So just like put in your stuff. That's about it, actually. Now that is it from my moving vlog. I will see you on the next one when I start redecorating the place and adding more furniture. But for now, this is it. I am tired. No much probably more tired than I am because I feel like she did most of the handwork. Is it handwork? Most heavy of the lifting. Huh? heavy lifting. Mm. Yeah, she said she did most of the heavy lifting. We'll call it heavy lifting for now, but like she just screwed a couple of things together. I'm joking. But <laughs> she did a lot you guys she did a lot she did way more than i would have actually done and she she actually pushed me to do way more because i would have left it at like 12. it's probably almost four o'clock right now and we've done enough like it's, it's it's at a point now where if i wanted to come sleep here i actually can um so we are done for today um i'll probably be back probably month end when i start filling up the place with more furniture but until then, um, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.